Hello friends and family. My name is Judy Love and thanks for coming to my channel. I just got back from the holidays. Well, it's actually been a few days. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie to you. Today, it's Saturday. We got back Monday morning from Miami. It was a really long drive and I have a lot of highlights and a lot of clips of the things that we did. Honestly, I'll be honest with you guys, during vacation, I don't tend to do a lot of things. So <laughs> um, there wasn't really much that I did do, but we went to a couple of food places that were really nice. And honestly, I spent the majority of my time on the beach because I just love being near bodies of water and I could literally spend all my time at the beach, which is what I did. Um, the first couple days, it was pretty cold for Miami weather. And again, this, I thought it wasn't gonna be that bad, honestly, for like, I thought Florida doesn't, you know, drop that low, but it got down to 34 degrees. 34 degrees and you're near the beach, it's freezing. So I didn't get to do a lot of things for the first couple nights, but then once it started to warm up, we finally went to the beach and everything like that. But let you guys see you know what we did so if you're new here please like and subscribe if you like this kind of content and share this with your friends families join the tribe join the journey so i'm definitely excited to have you guys here now let's get on to the vlog All right i'll talk to you guys soon The last time we did this car ride, we drove all the way to Miami straight without making any stops except for like getting gas, like getting food, going to the bathroom. This time we stopped in Georgia. Um, we stayed overnight at a hotel and then we started driving through Florida. Like people don't realize Florida is a long state to drive through. Just the state of Florida alone going from north to south to the tip. Miami Beach is at the bottom. That is an eight hour drive. We were so tired and so ready to be there and we reached Daytona. We were like, yay, five hours left. <laughs> oh my gosh. I absolutely hate doing this drive, but honestly hearing about all the things going on with the airlines now um, or that what happened during the holidays, I'm actually really happy we drove. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so even though this drive was pretty brutal, I'm glad that we chose to do what we did. waffle that waffle is huge like our portion sizes were so big but the food was so good at this place like i would totally recommend that you guys go there i'm here in miami beach north miami beach actually and we are heading over down to south beach i'm here for the holidays it is a lot colder than i had expected it to be um for florida weather it's like 40 degrees <laughs> so brian is over there waiting we're actually waiting for our lift and we're gonna go meet the rest of our family down because i had to make a pit stop back at the house but we're heading down to south beach right now so youtube we're here at the sls hotel look at this that's why you should stay at this is why we should work overnight you want to say hi to my brother? What's going on with y'all? Hey, I don't know what to say. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, this hotel was giving, giving bougie. I didn't want to film like there was a lot of people in there and a lot of workers. I wanted to respect their privacy. So I tried to get as much of the hotel as possible, but clearly I didn't do a 
good job at that um but i was able to get the outside part and get like the pool area it was luxurious and i just i felt like a queen just walking through there and getting a mini tour even though you know i can't afford to stay there today but one of these days i will be able to rent a room at this hotel because it was just amazing it was amazing i absolutely loved it babe i want to be We're on the beach right now. We're gonna walk over to the water and enjoy it even though it's cold. I really don't care how cold it is. I'm at least putting my feet in the water, you know? And definitely gonna enjoy myself here. And we're definitely hoping, I think, on um, Tuesday or Wednesday, the weather's going to get warmer. So we are really excited for that. <laughs> I'm still walking in the sand. Actually, it's kind of chilly over here. My hair is blowing in the wind. All right, now we're walking back. Um, hopefully, we'll be able to go to the beach sometime this week, but I'm just not sure yet. Or, no, we're gonna go to the beach. I'm not sure if it's going to be warmer. But I'm still gonna jump in there even if I catch cold. I don't really care. So far, we're having a really great time. I'm gonna focus on walking in the sand because I am struggling right now, guys. Okay, bye. <laughs> heading to the beach right now I don't know if you can hear me but it's a lot warmer today even though it's not sunny yet but we're still gonna try to go to the beach I gotta start walking now crossing the street we are walking walking 
to the beach. We're walking. Oh, that's actually a really good view of you right now. What? It's a very good view of you. Got some multi-million dollar homes right here. We're walking, 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 walking to the beach. And we're walking, walking, walking to the beach. The beach is empty, y'all. This is what happens when it's less than 70 degrees outside in Florida. No one's here. <laughs> We're just crazy, crazy northerners at the beach at 70 degree weather, but it's okay. Like, look at that. Look at that. Even though it's not warm, it feels amazing. People probably think we're crazy because it's probably cold for them, but we're good. Ryan, him. And then they did the call to call all the other seagulls over. The Jamaicans watching this video are gonna come for me, but the slogan of this restaurant is Come food, come feedy food, stay feedy vibes. I absolutely loved it. The music was bumping, food was on fire, my margarita was on point, my oxtail was falling off the bone. 10 out of 10, y'all. Hello friends, this is attempt number two of going to the beach. It's a lot warmer today, it's like 75 degrees and you definitely feel a lot more of the Miami weather. And the sun is out, so I'm definitely going to be getting my tan on, tan, <laughs> but definitely happy about this, this weather. Aren't you happy too? Yeah. We've made it to the beach and it is so sunny. The weather is nice. The sunscreen is making my skin glow. I'm happy. Ryan said he's ready to sleep because he's so relaxed. That water looks so much bluer today since the sun is out. <laughs> So 
so I'm done with the water for right now. And I got stung by a jellyfish, but it's okay because I ended up going back in the water anyways. Days at the beach. This weather is absolutely beautiful. This is Miami weather for sure. Like the past couple days it's been like very warm um but like not to like miami standards to the floridians it was really cold because it was like 60 degrees and like 70 degrees or low 70s and now we're hitting like the upper 70s and today is actually 80 and it's gonna hit 85 so we're back at the beach and i'm having a ball. I'm so happy because the weather is actually warm enough for me to get in the water and not like freeze. <laughs> I want to show you guys my view right now. The waves were pretty strong at this point so you guys probably wouldn't have heard what I said but um, they were a lot calmer than it was throughout the week so today was actually a lot safer um, and we were able to actually go into the water um, and just enjoy that warm Miami sun it's New Year's Eve and today is our last day here in Miami so we're gonna go to a Korean barbecue spot called drunken dragon um, looking forward to trying the food and seeing if it's good Korean barbecue so show you guys when we get in there when we first got to the location it really was such a shock such a hole in the wall you would not have known that this was inside of this building Good. That was really good. <laughs> While we waited for our meat to come in, we did order some appetizers. We got a bao, um, bulgogi bun, which was really good, some pot stickers, and then some yoza. I'm so sorry for the incorrect pronunciations. I'm trying. <laughs> Year it happens. Well, let's get back to real 